In today's video, we're searching for a card that I haven't pulled in three years, the Winged Dragon of Rob Ghost Rare. Time to do, 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 do. What's up guys, we are back with another old school Legendary Duelist opening. I'm calling it old school, it's three years old. It's not really old school, but for Legendary Duelists, this is back when they actually had interesting cards. Today we don't just have one box, we have two box. No, we have three box, you can't even see. But we have four boxes. Four boxes will be open today for Devin. He actually got these off Ruxin34.com and he said, I want these to be opened up. Let's get that ghost rare. And I'm hoping we can do it today. It's one in 12 boxes. So we get about a 33% chance for it to happen. And if you guys want to buy anything on Ruxin34.com and have it opened on a video, just go check it out. Link in the description. There's also items like PSA cards and stuff like that. Let's get into the video. Well, we have a giveaway first. I'll be giving away these three cards, Glory of the King's Hand, Duelist Kingdom, and Set Sail for the Kingdom. I believe these are from Yugi's Legendary Decks, not totally sure. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, let me know down below. Will we get the Ghost Rare today? We need some believers in the comments. All right, Devin, let's do this. Let's start off with one box. Let's go one at a time. Let's get that Ghost Rare. The, there are multiple boxes here, so it's like there is the potential to get multiple Ghost I mean, it's very, very unlikely. I mean, these are not from a case that I know of. I got these loose. So, you know, there's the chance there's no ghost rare. There's a chance there's multiple ghost rares. You know, you don't really know what it's going to be. So that's kind of the problem with loose boxes. You know, you're not totally sure what you're going to get, but at the same time, it's kind of like blisters. A little bit exciting. You might, why am I shuffling these? We have a lot of packs to open today. You know what? Let's just, let's just get this box out of here. This is what we're going to do. We're just going to get all of them out right now. All right. Before you, we have 128 packs, but we're going to say 100 pack opening of Legendary Duelist Rage of Raw. So unfortunately, I mean, it's a good thing and a bad thing, but unfortunately for us right now, the Egyptian God Slime just got reprinted. So it's not going to be worth much. Used to be a $50 card, but the real goal of this video, that's a non-guaranteed super, by the way, but I don't think it's worth anything, is to get that Ghost Rare. And if we can get a Ghost Rare that's actually not scratched, it's extremely, extremely rare. And that would be super valuable. So if we can make that happen, I think Raw, it's around $100, $120, but you can get like a PSA 10 to that thing. There's no telling. It's going to be a couple thousand probably, maybe even more. Let's see. We have Mount of the Bound Creator. All right, so we want to get Devin something crazy. So shout out to Devin for making this video happen. I appreciate you, Devin, and all the people who buy on Ruxin34.com in general. But you want it to be open. It's always great. Make some good good content. We have Mechlord Astro. That is an ultra. Not guaranteed. So the rarities in here, if you're not familiar with Legendary Duelist, are common, rare, super rare is not guaranteed, ultra is not guaranteed, and then a ghost rare. That's the highest rarity. There's no secrets in here. So it's kind of weird. Like the, the ghost rare is like the big, big one. And then after that, everything's just kind of, you know, iffy when it comes to like high rarity. So that's kind of the problem with these sets. Back when they actually had like some unique cards and like cards actually people actually wanted like ghost rare, wing, dragon, and raw, they did pretty well. But the recent ones, like the last three years, they've been really bad. So this has been, this was definitely a, the best one we've had recently, Genzo. And then before that, we had Magical Hero, which did really well. There's no Ghost Rare in there, but it still did really well because it was Dark Magician support and everything. Like, most of the first six were pretty good, and then after that, it kind of fell apart. Token Sunday, I'm really hoping today... I've not pulled this Winged Dragon of Raw since my live stream on New Year's Eve 2020, I believe. I think that was when we pulled it. It was like the, the stream to 50k. We didn't quite make it because I didn't know how long it would take back then i didn't i didn't have the live streaming experience we have now of just how long some of them take and we ran out of time had to leave but still went pretty well it was a great memory we had some really awesome pulls i remember chels came in to help us with that box the last part of the the wing dragon and raw stuff and we got the ghost share it's pretty cool we have a psychic shockwave that was a ruxin special so i'm hoping today devin can have a little bit of luck and get that ghost rare maybe even double ghost rare if we get super luck i mean that would be extremely lucky let's be honest i don't want to put it in your head that we're gonna get two ghost rares so i'll take it back we have mech lord amplifier I mean, one, I'm going to be super happy. I'm going to be super happy if we get one. We're about four out of 12 chance. So one in three. Resolute Mech Lord. A little fraction action there. Fraction action. Kind of like that. Fraction action. All right. We have Mech Lord Army. So many Mech Lords. Not very important. Genzos are cool. I wish there was more high rarity Genzo stuff in here. It's mostly common. I guess you do have that one Genzo guys in Ultra Rare. But yeah, they, they could have they done more. They could have made regular Genzo and Ulti in here. I'm just saying. It could have been cool. Mech Lord Army. Okay. Yeah. More Mech Lords. Not what you're really excited about in here. Jinzo, Mech Lord. What's the other one? God Slime. Yeah, this, the uh, the God Slime stuff. We have Psychic Shockwave Reactor Slime ourselves. I wonder what the God Slime goes 
for now. I bet it's down like 10 bucks now because like it won't go completely to like zero because there's not that many listings at the moment. But with the new like seven printings and everything, you can get a much better, cooler looking version. It's not going to do so well, but I bet it's down from like 50 to 10 at the moment. Amplifier, that's my guess. Monster Reborn. Well, you never know with those. Like there could be so little listings, like the people just don't adjust their listing and it just stays there at whatever price it was. I mean, usually it's gonna go down though. We have Genzo Jactor, Sun God Unification, and a Cyber Energy Shock. So many packs here today. So many packs. Let's get Devin something. Come on, Mech Lord. Token Stampede, Mech Lord. We wanna get something crazy. It's Yu-Gi-Oh time. Yu-Gi-Oh! Bum, 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 bum. Great Beats of the Sky. Make yourself known. Let's go. Token Sunday, Chaos Infinity, Reboot. Millennium Revelation, pretty cool looking card, but yeah, not that crazy. There's not a lot of cards worth anything in here anymore, thanks to uh, the reprints there, but the Wing Dragon of Raw alternate art is also good. That's an ultra that's about 15 bucks, I think, last I checked. Uh, it might've actually gone up to 20. I'm not totally sure, but it's pretty decent. That and the Ancient Chant is probably still holding as a decent card. That doesn't have like a major reprint yet. Before when it was those two and the God Slime and the Ghost Rare, you actually had some pretty good options for like decent cards, but one has been taken away with the God Slime, but even, even then we still have some good options for a legendary duelist because a lot of time these don't have really anything like recently okay keep it going four boxes to be open today token stampede mech lord guardian slime that is the wrong slime that is a slime ultra but it is the wrong slime guardian slime we're looking for egyptian god slime that would be better we have uh Jiragetto. left arm psychic shockwave the mech lord nucleus infinity core okay cool stuff mech lord we have brain control holding legs oh rux is special the resolute mech lord army all right good stuff what else can we get here we have left arm offering mech lord emperor boon of the mech lord army true name man we're getting all the bad ones <laughs> we're getting all the bad ultras true name is not a good one it's a cool card it's like very anime-esque but it's not a good one. We're also Disciple, Jinzo Returner. We just need that one good one, though. All we need is that one good one. We'll be happy. We definitely want to get that Ghost Rare. Obviously, the alternate art's really cool as well. So those would both be really nice. Cosmo Channeling. Probably like a box in or so right now. Maybe, no, maybe a little bit more than that. And we have not really gotten much. We have Chaos Infinity, Reboots, Metal Reflect Slime. Reflect Slime was actually really expensive in Ultimate Rare before this. The Ultra was like something crazy. It was like 50 bucks, 40 bucks. I don't remember what it was, but it was something insane. Genzo Lord, I don't remember even what was using it, but I was like, I remember getting an Ultra from Phantom Darkness, not like pulling it, but just had one somewhere. And I was like, why is this so expensive? Upside down, a Grinnell, Amplifier, Returner, Mech Lord Assembly, another super. All these foils so far, not a good one yet. Been pretty rough so far. We want to get Devin something better than that. Come on, Resolute Mech Lord Army, Monster Reborn, Genzo. I mean, Genzo's cool. It's a great to have a lot of Genzo commons. Can't complain about Genzo. He's just awesome. We have Mind Control, Token Stampede, Mech Lord Astro, Ancient Chant. There we go. That's the best card we've pulled so far. Ancient Chant Ultra Rare. That used to be like close to 30. For a while, it was more than that, I think. But I think now it was, or last I checked, it was like 28, 26. We'll see if it's held up or not. But pretty nice card right there. Genzo Jack holding arms Ross disciple Jenzo returner so it's nice to get a good card now we're kind of looking for that wing dragon raw alternate art as our other awesome card i mean multiple ancient chant wouldn't be bad either brain control holding legs resolute mechord army mount of the bound creator we just want to try and make some of that money back before we get that ghost rare we have resolute or we can get the ghost rare first who cares wizzell we have token stampede so many packs left a lot of opportunities lots and lots of opportunities you just got to believe rux and special jury ghetto Jinzo, there's Jinzo, the Machine Menace. I feel like we might have pulled him earlier, but not crazy valuable, unfortunately. He is cool because he's Jinzo, but I don't think he was ever very playable, and so people didn't really didn't really catch on very well. Holding arms. We've gotten like almost all the ultras in the set, I feel like. Returner and Cosmo. Might actually like complete the set, minus the Wing Dragon Raw at this rate. Who knows? After a set completion the other day, I'm now just thinking about completing sets. We have Metal Reflect Slime, Mechlord Fortress. Law of Cosmos. We hadn't gotten that one, so that's going to help our set that we are arbitrarily creating right here. Is arbitrarily, is that the right word there? I'm not totally sure what that word means. Scale, we have Raw's Disciple and Reactor Slime. Still a lot of packs, still a lot of chances. Still want that ghost. Come on, Genzo Lord, Mech Lord, Mech Lord. Psychic Mega Cyber. Cool stuff, but it's also not what we're looking for. We have a Holding Legs, Reboot, Mind Control, Bang Control, and Mind Control both in there. Okay. This, this pack's been... I've had an eye on it because it's had like a bent top the whole time. Will there be a ghost in this one? Monster Reborn, Genzo, Mechlord Emperor, Rizal. Okay, Rizal's back at it. We have a Mechlord Emperor of... Was the Army of Rizal. More Army. More Emperor and Army. Monster Reborn, Mechlord Destruction. 
We probably have almost all the supers and ultras. I'm not going to lie. We don't have two of the best ultras, though. The God Slime and the uh, alternate art Wing Dragon of Raw. Raw's Disciple. I feel like we have not pulled that yet. We probably have, and I just missed it, but somehow I haven't noticed that yet. We have a Jinzo Lord. I wonder how big this set is. I actually don't know in terms of number of cards. Psychic Mega Cyber. I mean, it's not 567 like Rarity Collection, that's for sure. Because there's no extra versions. It's like, there's two Wing Dragon and Rob, but they're different cards. Millennium Revelation, same card we've already pulled. Give us those good ones. We have a Mechlord Fortress, Holding Legs, Genzo, Mechlord Astro Dragon, Triskelion. I think we've already gotten that as well. Already gotten that one. We have Amplifier, Mind Control, Meta Reflex Slime, Chaos Infinity, and Psychic Mega Cyber. 100 pack opening. I mean, it's going, yeah, it's going okay. We really want to pull those big ultras at least. The ghost rare is like obviously the main goal, but getting all the ultras would be cool. Jurigato offering. I can't pull it. Okay, I thought it might mint something. Maybe it was stuck to the ghost rare. That'd be kind of bad if it like ripped the foiling. We have brain control, Genzo, psychic bounder. We don't have that either. Okay. I'm interested at the end to see like maybe if we pulled all the cards. Brain control, we have holding arms, monster reborn. It'd be kind of crazy to get the whole set in four boxes, but it's a little easier in these. Legendary duelist to pull stuff like that. Uh, Mechlord, no like crazy high ratio. Genzo again, obviously the Ghost Rare is one in 12 boxes. That's pretty rare, but you get lucky and pull that. It's not that crazy. Resolute, Boon, Mechlord, Token Stampede, and another Mechlord. Still many packs to be open. Oh, what are we down to? Box and a half, two boxes, something like that. Holding legs, amplifier. Not really sure. I'm just kind of eyeballing it, which is usually not very accurate for me. I'm usually pretty slow with that. Holding arms, Mechlord. Another Mechlord. Oh, the Obligato. I don't know if we have that yet. That might be a new super rare for us. Definitely gotten some dupes so far, so that could be impacting it as well. We have Mechlord Fortress, Jinzo, Mechlord Armory, Skill. Pack stack's getting a little bit, a little bit smaller. It's not really a stack. It's like a line over there. White Aura. Okay, another Ultra we don't have. Okay, we're, we're getting some different ones. We're getting some different ones. I'm liking this. We have Jurigato. Left arm, mech lord, brain control, because you do get five ultras per box in here, so we should get 20 ultras, 20 or 20 to 24, because you could sometimes get six. So we should get a lot of them. If we don't get too many doubles, we should get everything, I think. I think there's only 10 in here, but I could be wrong. There might be more than that because you get so many. We have Mech Lord, Chaos Infinity, Mech Lord Assembly. I think we already had that. Nothing too crazy there. Amplifier, Reboot, Brain Control, Mech Lord, Cosmo Channeling. Good stuff, but not quite good enough. Where is that alternate art wing dragon of Raw? Where is that Egyptian God Slime? Even though it got reprinted, we still want it because that's still going to be one of the better cards. Genzo. It's gonna be better than some of these other ones. I mean, it's gotta be over a dollar still, I think. I mean, right now it's almost certainly over a dollar because there's no way people are just like racing to list theirs for 50 cents. We have Boone, we have Mechlord, Law of the Cosmos for the third time, I believe. No, maybe only the second time. I'm thinking of Millennium Revelation, I think. All right, come on, Devin. We need some luck. We have Blaze Cannon. Okay, another new one. How many ultras there are? Feels like we pulled a lot right now. We still have two that I know of that we haven't gotten. Psychic Shockwave, Genzo. Cyber Energy Shock. A lot of Ultras today. Mechlord Emperor's Yell, Raw's Disciple, Reboot, Mind Control. A wild monster appears. Ba -da -ba -da -dun 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 -dun. It's Pokemon. Monster Reborn, we have Genzo. Genzo Jector, Holding Arms. Mound of the Bound Creator. Pretty good card. That should have been hollow in here, to be honest. Would have been way cooler than a rare. We have a Brain Control. Probably just make it more accessible. A Mechlord Army. Obligato. I've gotten one of those before. So many foils, but not the ones we're looking for right now. Jinzo, Token, Chaos Infinity. We have gotten one that we're looking for. The rest has been a little bit iffy. Boon. Mechlord. Jurigetto. Ruxin Special. Past the Psychic Shockwave. But not anything crazy. What if we Ruxin Special past the Winged Dragon Rock Ghost Rare? I have done it before where I've Ruxin Special past a big hit. Amplifier. The true name. Okay, we're getting repeats of ones we don't really want. All right. Still packs left. Still more chances at the Ghost. Come on. Let's switch it up. Okay, yeah. Okay. We're trying it. We're trying it. We're trying to get that Ghost. We have a... Oh, there it is. The Egyptian God Slime. Used to be a $50 card not quite anymore but hey we'll take that ultra rare egyptian gods i feel like i didn't give it enough love let's revisit it i know some people in the comments are like hey show it a little longer okay i will egyptian god slime really cool looking card i mean it can't really compare with the rarity collection versions unfortunately but it is the original so there, it has that going for it all right you can kind of see the whole the whole thing left all the packs left we have gotten everything i think that we really want besides the two ghost or not the ghosters the two uh, Wing Dragon of Ross. We have both the alternate art ultra rare that we want to get and the ghost rare. We have not gotten either of them so far. 
So we're looking to turn that around right now. Let's see if we can do it. We have a Resolute Mech Lord army, token stampede. Come on, holding arms. Jinzo Returner, okay. These are fine, they're fine, but we're not really what we're looking for. Give us that Winged Dragon Raw, one, one or the other, I mean, at least. Sun God Unification, do we have that? Maybe not. All right, I just went through the foils we pulled. We have eight different supers and eight different ultras. I'm guessing there are 10 of each. I don't know what supers we don't have, but I know, or at least one more ultra that we don't have. We don't have the Winged Dragon Raw alternate art, so I'm guessing there's one more we don't have. There's probably a couple more supers we don't have. So we have a lot of the cards in the set. We're only missing, I'm guessing, five, including the Ghost Rare. I mean, the commons, maybe it's unlikely, but I feel like we pulled all the commons and rares. Why Aura Bahamut? We did have that one already. Where is that Winged Dragon of Raw in any form? We have Mechlord Infinity Core. We did have that. Pulling everything we have already. We have like four of some copies of things. It's kind of crazy. We have a Jinzo Returner. Still a lot of chances though. I'm not giving up yet. Still a lot of chances for Devin. Let's see if we can turn it around for him. That pack didn't want to open. We have a Psychic Bounder. We did have one of those. Packs not wanting to rip correctly right now. Maybe I'm just messing it up. We have Token Stampede, Mech Lord. Still many chances to get a Ghost Rare Winged Dragon of Raw. Here we go. We have a Genzo Returner. Maybe we'll get a Ghost Rare Genzo Error Pack. That'd be pretty amazing. Holding Legs. Mech Lord Assembly, I think we had two of those, yeah. Building the Mech Lords. They were ripping good earlier. They're not ripping good anymore. We have the Amplifier. I don't know what's going Maybe it's a new box or something, and they're like a little bit different. See, they're always ripping like diagonally, and that makes it so hard to open them. They're like so much slower, at least. We have a Boon of the Mech Lord Emperor. I wonder how many copies they have of these commons. Probably have like 10 of each. <sighs> we have Mind Control, Mech Lord Asterisk. That was a good one. We have a Mechlord Emperor Grinnell. Okay. Resolute. Token Stampede. Kind of on a dry streak here. Not even getting like supers right now. Okay. Psychic Shockwave. Not getting too much here. We want to turn this around. We have a Jet Man. It's all just commons. Okay. Did we pull everything already? I did a little bit of mixing, but not too much. We have a Genzo Jector. Maybe they're all going to be at the end. We're going to go crazy here in a second. Oh, that just completely ripped. Uh, Psychic Shockwave, Mechlord Astro Dragon. We got this, everybody. Don't give up. Millennium Revelation. Oh, maybe there are only eight supers. I doubt it, but it seems a little weird. We've only gotten eight supers. I don't even know how many supers you get in here. I'm guessing a lot if you get five ultras. Uh, okay, Triskelion, have that ultra rare. Whatever, not too exciting. We have a, yeah, Guardian Slime. That's a play set of those, I think. Play set of the slime. I mean, I'm, I'm guessing they short printed some in here. I wouldn't be shocked. It is a thing that has happened with Konami in the past. I mean, I know, it's shocking. It's shocking that they might have short printed something. We have a Guardian Slime again. Okay, okay. I don't remember specifically because I didn't open a lot of cases back then. So I think I only opened one case of this to get the uh, Ghost. We have Law of the Cosmos. We had that, I believe. Had a couple of those, actually. Metal Reflex Slime, Jorgetto. Oh my goodness, we are down to the last few packs. I mean, we had 20 packs still, but Ross Disciple. We got at least three of those, so that's good. We got Ross Disciple ready to be tributed to the Winged Dragon of Raw. Left Arm Offering, Holding Arms. What do we have now? Reboot, Left Arm Offering again. Come on, Winged Dragon of Raw. Where are you? You're trying to hide out completely, not show your face in any form? Okay, Synchro Absorption. We did not have that, so that's one we don't have, I think. Pretty sure that's a new one. Is it just Mechlord stuff we don't have? It's kind of lame. We have... Oh, there it is! The alternate art, Winged Dragon of Raw. There we go. Now we're talking. Winged Dragon of Raw alternate art. Look at this thing. Really cool artwork on him. Really nice. That's really sick. So that gives us nine different ultras. I don't know if there's 10 or not. I should probably look. There is only nine. What the heck? Wait, maybe I was wrong. There's only eight supers. Okay, I just checked and there are only nine ultras and then there are only eight supers. So I guess we did already have that ninth super I thought we had. What a weird ratio of cards so you're gonna get almost all the supers in one box pretty weird and uh we've been through four almost four boxes we've gotten every card basically so he has the the rage of raw set essentially except the ghost rare and that's obviously what we want so let's see if we can get that final card for him infinity core okay still some chances though still some chances we have a everlasting we want to get that psa 10 worthy one that'd be pretty amazing okay mech lord emperor of skill 
We have a Raw's Disciple, Psychic Bounder. So you're just going to keep getting the same supers because there's, you know, not very many of them. There's only eight supers. It's kind of strange. I thought there'd be at least 10, but no. Nine ultras, eight super. Less supers than ultras. Kind of strange. Left arm offering. Oh, it's coming down to the end. I'm getting nervous. Come on, let's get that ghost. I know it's not guaranteed. It's one in, one in, uh, okay, true name. I looked in, uh, Guardian Slime's actually the fifth best card in the set at like three bucks, so. It falls off drastically. Egyptian God Slime still says an average of 49. I'm guessing that that is averaging all the old ones with like the brand new like tanking price. So it's definitely not 49, but that is it might say something crazy like that at first. Okay, more ultras we don't really need. We need a ghost, come on, for Devin. Gotta believe. All it takes is one pack to really turn it around. Mechlord Army of Grinnell. We at least got the other Ultras, which is good. We got the good Ultras. That's nice to see. They seem they seem like they're harder to get because we got like two and three copies of all those, even four, and we have one of all of those. So seems like they might be a little bit more rare, short printed, if you will. Sun God Unification. I, was, I thought that might have been new, and I looked and we had three of them. <laughs> like I guess I didn't really notice before. I just kind of. Blew through it. We have a Mech Lord Astro Dragon. Let's keep it going. What can we do? Holding arms. We have a Resolute Mech Lord Army. We have a Boon of the Mech Lord Emperor. Holding arms. What else can we do? Mech Lord Assembly. Okay, more supers. We are down to less than 10 packs now. I think this is our ninth to the last pack. Token Stampede. How epic would it be if it's in the last pack? I'm not feeling too good. I'm feeling a little nervous, but you just got to believe, guys. Believe in the comments right now. Send some luck to Devin. Let him know that we're gonna get lucky here. We're gonna get something crazy. Okay, that didn't that that didn't work. <sighs> left arm offering. I feel like it's always there. I feel like I'm offering my left arm right now. Come on, Raw's disciple, Jinzo Lord. Please, five packs left. Don't let this happen. Ah, uh, four packs left. Wing Dragon of Raw, Great Beast of the Sky. Hear my cry. The Millennium Revelation. Show your ghostly face to us, unscratched and unblemished. We shall grade you, the true name, in the perfect tenth. I don't know why I need to feel like I need to add the F there. Okay, we have a, okay, it's down the last pack, guys. Devin, congrats on the full set, but the full, full set would be great if we could get right here. Guys, if you've enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe and thank Devin in the comments for making this video happen. Well, let's congratulate him on this ghost shirt we're about to get right here. Okay, we're gonna get that rare to the front just so we can make it exciting. Everlasting Alloy, come on. Wizzell. Wizzell. Resolute Mech Lord Army, our final chance right here. Here we go. Come on, Devin. We're going to have to reborn it and give it another shot at another date. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was super fun. It was crazy that we pulled all the cards except the one that we really want. Shout out to Tone Fo Show, Daxter, Tomato Juice, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, America Doyster, Supreme Sage 21, CJ, Liu, Gwine 62, Yu-Gi-Oh! Unboxed, and Natai Show, Ian Musa Jr. Bardic, Robert F., Thomas McLean, and Changa Lang. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.